welcome to the next vlog. Uh, we've come out to the Victorian high country. Uh, we're currently set up at the Dargo Hotel for one night uh, until the Pine Annex campsite. We've got um, enough fuel, groceries and water to spend about seven days out here. So we'll see how we go day by day. Um, see how many tracks we get done around the area um, and go from there. So we'll probably go for a drink at the pub soon. Yeah. Sounds good, yeah. Um, and have a fire. And that's about it, I think. We'll probably see you tomorrow. Morning guys, day two out in the Vic High Country. We left the camp out the back of Dargo Pub this morning um, and we've just headed up the road a little bit to a, another little free camp um, right by the river. So we've just done a quick setup. We want to get out and hit the track. So um, we haven't completely set everything up, just the basics and we'll come back and finish it off. Um, but yeah, we're going to go hit the tracks. Where are we heading first, Al? Um, well, Sunday here, so we go to the hard tracks where there might be a bit of traffic. So we're going to head up to the Blue Rag Range Track. going down and then a massive incline. I don't think the camera really shows it, but Elle's just gone to suss it out, pick the line. Thoughts? Okay. Steep. Uh, doable? I think so. <laughs> We're doing it. Pretty slow going downhill, it's pretty good. All right, so we just come off the Blue Rag Range track. Um, we was told that it was fairly easy going. Well, all of people. the, what online says it's easy. Online says it's pretty easy. And we went and saw the general store manager down in Dargo and he said, no, no worries. No worries, but they didn't tell us you need a second pair of undies. <laughs> it was pretty, pretty crazy for us. 
Um, we're still quite novice. Well, I'm still a novice four-wheel driver, so uh, we did get stuck going down, uh, going up one part of the track on the way out, um, and we didn't actually make it to the lookout. Sorry about all the flies. Um, so yeah, so we did get stuck, but we did, we've made it back out and. Just about to air back up and head back down to camp. But yeah, other than that. It was pretty fun. Pretty fun. Well, now looking back at it, mm. Elliot experience. was shitting his pants. It was a good experience. However, we don't like doing crazy stuff because this car has to take us the whole way around Australia on a minimal budget. We, so, don't, want to, we don't want to break anything, basically. Yeah, but it was pretty fun what we did Pretty yes. Do you think I chose the wrong footwear to wear today? Yes. I think I'm gonna need a shower. It's <laughs> disgusting. It is very dusty, hey? Yes, dusty and flies! The car is gonna need a good clean when we get off the high country. Very dusty, still actually dirty from, when do we go four wheel driving? In Malacuda. Four wheel driving in Malacuda. Malacuda? Yeah. Where? Um, yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's still dirty from four wheel driving in Malacuda in the national park there, so. Well due for a clean when we get back. I have got so much dust up my nose. Your nose? Yeah, it's all stuck up there. I wonder yeah. if this can blow it out. I would say so. <laughs> Everything still looks pretty good. Okay. So we just finished setting up for the day. We just got back and set up. Got a fire going, shower tent. This is the most set up we have been since been on the road. Hey, ever. ever. So yeah, we might do a walk through of our setup, maybe. And we're right on the Thanks to the Dargo River just over there. Pretty good. They look so big. Well, they are big. Nachos dinner. Oh, yeah. With a butane tour. 